Hello and welcome to The Founder. We are here once again at the Colombo Cooperative and it's all about putting new startups and new businesses on the spot to let you know about uh, what Sri Lanka is up to and uh, all about the build-ups that are coming up to this very day. Uh, today, uh, we are going to talk about something absolutely yummy. And uh, my question is, what's a party without a platter? We have Shanika with us who is uh, from Platter Parties. How are you doing today? Thank you. Thank awesome. you for having me on your show. You are welcome. And tell me all about Platter Parties, where it all began, the initial step, everything. So basically, uh, Platter Parties came to being in uh, the last quarter of 2018. Nice. So uh, it's quite recent. It's very recent. It's very new. Um, I just moved down back to Sri Lanka and while entertaining at home, uh, platters was a normal thing and everyone was kind of saying, oh, you should do this. You should do this. Oh, okay. Yeah. And yeah, so I took the idea and then came up with the name. Didn't take long because uh, uh, platters for parties. So exactly. Platter yeah. parties and then that's how it all started. And I imagine you're, you're very, um, you know, you, you like doing this. Yes, and it's something that you're passionate about. So I can see, you know, just looking at your Instagram page, there's a lot of love uh, created into these as well. Yes, because I've brought in all my experience uh, running a restaurant, catering, okay. doing events back in Dubai. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'm not that great in the kitchen, but mm -hmm. anything creative and putting, uh, designing stuff is something I love, so okay. um, I enjoy it. Okay, <laughs> that's good. You have to enjoy what you like. Yes. And how was it initially uh, putting out your first um, platter for a customer? Um, basically, um, I have a very supportive family yes. and nice friends, so <laughs> uh, it was kind of easy. Uh, just through word of mouth. Through word of the, mouth, okay. Yeah, that's how we started. And then uh, if you notice, we don't have um, an active Facebook page or right. a website. Uh, it's through Instagram. through Instagram. That's the way we kind of show what we okay. do to... So you would say that's your main marketing strategy? Yes. Word of mouth and Instagram. Referrals okay. and word of mouth, repeat clients. That's, that's the way we're going at the moment okay. uh, until now, okay. of course. We have to change plans, but, yeah. Uh, yeah, so far so good. Okay, so tell me what platter parties offer. We basically offer, we started with the cheeses and the charcuterie boards, and then we uh, kind of came up with a concept that mainly is to do with um, elegance and uh, uh, ease when entertaining okay. at home and um, gourmet gift boxes and uh, for events like a gourmet focal point okay so that was the concept when we when we put this whole mm -hmm. idea together and uh, that's what it has been so far but we have kept adding different types of product mm -hmm. like sweet platters fruit platters uh, for different occasions mm -hmm. uh, since we also customize that's uh, something that's Yes, um, one of our core uh, values that we kind of offer to people. Right. So, Shanika, tell me about the platters you have. Well, what are the ranges that, that it starts kind of from? The, pri the pricing and well, values that mm -hmm. we kind of offer. Right. What you want and, and um, also uh, well, values that right. we kind of offer. Right. Okay. So, and. So, uh, can you tell me what um, has How been the most challenging thing right. so far with the okay. platter parties? To be honest, I think how many people you're working with. Right, yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah. Challenging, so... I bet that's because of the support system, the right. good yes. support yeah. system that you have. Okay, okay. So, yeah, that's, that's pretty cool. So, Sharika, if there was ever an opportunity for you to sit at dinner with a founder that you admired, locally or internationally, uh, who would it be and who would you choose? Okay, so definitely a woman. <laughs> and um, yeah, so Victoria Beckham. Oh, wow. Yeah, she's someone I admire and get some kind of inspiration from. And uh, Michelle Obama and Oprah. 
oh, for nice. the international, I would think, these two women. And uh, locally, I would I would say Darshi okay. from Buddhi Batiks because uh, she's, uh, you know, taken, she's someone who started an industry and I mean, there's so many who are now uh, following her footsteps right. kind of, but she's one of the pioneers in the industry. So I would think it would be Dashi. Okay. Now I have to say your uh, Instagram page is absolutely beautiful. It's colorful. Everything you need for a yummy, yummy platter is there on your page. Uh, who handles your Instagram? Is it solely you? Yes, the Instagram page, I manage the page, but um, uh, when coming to taking pictures, it's uh, my business partner. She does a great job with the pictures. Yeah. And I do too at times. Uh, but yeah, so that's all. It's team effort. Yeah, that's yeah. good. And we would love to uh, try it as well. So, any new sure. plans for the year 2020? Yeah, so since um, the. Uh, Planner parties uh, sort of created, set a trend and took Colombo by storm, I yes, think. Yes, absolutely. Uh, so there's platters, there's now everyone has a platter and that's, that's something nice to see and to us that means that's uh, success yes. by in itself. Exactly. Uh, to see so many following in that, um, following a, something that someone sort of create platters were always there yeah. but it just got more focus now I so. think platters you know goes pretty much go back all the way to like the Egyptian yeah. times right exactly. when the yeah the um, grapes and the, the grapes and yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, so the kind of that grazing uh, concept we brought it in and uh, now it's it's something that you find everywhere which is great so we, we we need to set another trend now. Exactly. And uh, yeah, so for 2020 we have big plans. Uh, we've come up with a concept called the 369 Platter Project. Oh, nice. So that's going to be launched on the 9th of uh, January. And what exactly is that about? Can you give us a teaser, so, maybe? <laughs> well, it's going to be something that makes it so much easier. Okay. For everyone. Oh, really? Yes. Okay, like just like so what they want. Yeah, expect. just taking it to the next level now seeing that um, everyone has a platter on on a table this festive season I think m people many people I know had platters and that's awesome yeah so now we're trying to enhance that okay. and uh, add a few more um, what you call uh, sort Teams. of services okay, yeah. that uh, that would uh, complement yeah. this whole concept of entertaining mm -hmm. and uh, events yeah. and uh, styling your life kind of yeah yeah, yeah. and thing. it's something so, that's always changing right according to a theme or you know yes. if it's out of the there could be an out yeah, of the planet definitely so that's amazing that's good so we're going to be doing some interesting stuff in 2020 so yeah so there you go yeah. that's going to be exciting and thank you so much for uh, being with us and at the same time there's one more question that we got asked this is from our venue sponsor colombo cooperative uh creating wonderful workspaces like this creative spaces for companies um starting from scratch from all sizes alike uh they would like to know what your favorite productivity hack is so um, I would say uh, for me personally, it's it has and has, has always been task uh, task lists. Okay. So to get anything done, I would need a task list, and I generally would have to write it down on a book, not type it, type it or, down, yeah. or get it on the phone, so then it it registers in my head, and then when you see it mm -hmm. scratched off, that's like a huge satisfaction. Yes. So yeah, I mean to be organized, organized. And even with the platters, it's not something that you can just come and put together. I mean, if you want it to be perfect and also customized, there's a lot of things to take into consideration, uh, especially of what the client wants and uh, the time and the type of people he's going or she is going to serve. So all of that needs to be written down and scratched off once it's done. So I think task list would be my number one. Okay. <laughs>
Shanika, there's a lot of uh, businesses out here, like new startups, and uh, there are still people trying to do their own thing. What kind of advice can you give uh, for the upcoming startups or someone who wants to pursue their dreams, just like you have? Yeah, I would say don't waste your energy. Mm -hmm. Focus on your dream. Uh, don't get distracted by anything negative. Yeah. Uh, and don't let that uh, sort of bring you down and set doubt in. Just focus on your dream. Don't worry about what the others are doing. Keep it in that kind of mindset is definitely a winner. Absolutely. That's a really good piece of advice. And I hope that you check out Platter Parties, uh, parties yourself. Uh, like I was talking to Shanika, it's uh, it's something to do with interaction, like you said, right? Yes. I mean, if, if you... Um, when you see a, a sort of a platter where everybody's sitting and picking food and trying to see what is that and uh, trying to ask each one what's what is this what's sharing it? and fighting for something <laughs> that's the joy of bringing everyone together and that that's that's the joy for us too mm -hmm. you know to see someone enjoying uh, food and having fun and mingling and uh, networking so it's something that's quite an interactive interactive uh, uh, addition to any table setting or any event or uh, mm -hmm. so, function. Yeah, for yeah. sure. And uh, you know, I can't wait to try it myself. So thank Definitely you so much. You will be so. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Yes. So thank you so much for joining us, and wish you all the very best for a brand new year. Thank you and, so uh, much. And more fun platters to come. <laughs> thank you. Thank you for having me. Thank you again. So there you go. That was Shanika from the Platter Parties uh, right here on the Founder. See you next time.